Hello everybody. It's been raining for the last couple days and it's supposed to rain some more, but we need it because we're in a drought. So everything can actually get green now, which will be good, including all this new grass, which I guess Don's going to have to try to gently mow it eventually here. Pretty soon, I would think, with the push mower, so he doesn't yank it all up. And there's some more growing here, too, because before this we had no grass here. Tug! Tug followed me out and he went underneath the trailblazer right there. And here comes Gizzard. Gizzard! Come on! Where are you going? Go see Tug! And right behind me is Don. He just walked out. So hopefully it doesn't start raining because I want to sit out here a little bit. It's really humid though. Yeah, it is. It's not necessarily so much the heat, it's more of the humidity. Of it, which yeah, we're supposed to get thunderstorms and there's a, humidity and thunderstorms go hand in hand. Yep. Don finally got the both greenhouses all set up and braced and all that good job yeah yeah second one's not 100 percent done yet but really close to being done yeah yeah just going in and doing the final touches on tying down the plastic and and how did you attach them together um here be easier to walk this way and Really can't see from the outside, but that's fine. I'm going to be adding in more supports here. I'm going to tie them together, but okay. I got a rope that runs through and goes around and tighten tying them together. Okay. And what I'm doing is I'm sucking them together as tight as I can, and yeah. then once they're all once the two pieces, two frames are connected together, then I'm going to go along with a uh, flex seal tape oh, okay. up along the whole entire seam, all, all right. the way up over top, down the other side with flex seal tape. What the waterproof stuff? Yeah, they sell but, that at Dollar General. Yeah, but it would probably probably be cheaper at Walmart. <laughs> yeah, but we'll need a roll roll of that. But. Yeah. And there is some tears in the greenhouse plastic, like you can see one oh. up right there. So Where you can patch go along them? and put a piece of uh, that flex seal yeah. waterproof, that water tape. Yeah. Where it'll stick even underwater, that kind yeah. of tape. I know. I think we've all seen the commercial. Yeah. <laughs> so, and then this one here has got a tear in it. You know, there's tears and stuff in them, but not a lot of them. Like there's one here. Oh. Uh, there you, was, that was supposed to be a tie, that where it tied down to the frame here. Yeah. And when it got wind damage, it ripped that, ripped the tie part down on the plastic half. Oh. And then it ended up with a tear there. Oh, okay. But, other than that, it's up. Yeah. It's and braced so it doesn't blow over or crush or fly away. Yeah. Like right there is a post on the inside right there. Yeah, your wooden posts you made. Yeah, to help give it support. Like you can see Buried there. two feet into the ground. Yeah, and then you can see there's another hole there. Yeah. White storm! What are you doing here? But, yep. Big long thing. Uh, 40 foot. 40 feet? Yeah, 40 feet long by 10 foot wide. Okay. Look at the pretty kitties under the bush. White Storm and Gizzard. What are you looking for? Grass to eat? <laughs> yeah, Gizzard. But yeah, White Storm learned how to come outside, and he's been good about it, so staying in the yard, so he'll be fine. <laughs> and then there's Smokey. Smokey! <laughs> Wee! <laughs> See? He can't run like that in the house. He loves to run. 
Right, White Storm? You need your exercise. Look, it's a cat gathering. <laughs> and Spotted Leaf and Kylo are in the house. They're the ones we don't want to come out, especially Spotted Leaf, because she we know she runs away for days. But these guys are good about it. <laughs> Just watching the greenhouse. Smokey. White Storm. Such a pretty kitty. And Gizzard. Yes, you're pretty too. All the kitties are pretty. <laughs> what do you There you go. Gizzard. can hear somebody's dog barking from way far away. Don't know if you guys can or not. But that's what they're looking at now. Like a mile away or something. Smokey! Good boy, Smokey. So Don just mowed that new grass. It looks good. And it did not tear out of the ground. So a while back, a couple weeks ago, I got this Dark Knight Templar Snag the Tag tag. What this is, is it's related to geocaching and a person hides a tag, people, lots of people. There was a light one and there was a dark one. Well, I got a dark one. And the first person to find it keeps it. And then they can send for shipping, just pay shipping on the other part of it, which this is the other part of it, and it's stained glass, and it's a compass, except the, no, I guess the E is not backwards, and it goes like this, and there, that's the whole Dark Knight Templar snag the tag thing, whatever this thing is. <laughs> and the first time I did it, it was this mammoth tag, which this was the part that you send for where all, you only have to pay a few bucks shipping. So it's really cool. And it goes like this with magnets. So it's definitely a, a fun thing to do. Snagthetag.com. Not sponsored. It's free. So there's no sponsoring. But if you want to do it, you go to snagthetag.com, sign up, and then turn on reminders for each game. And you just find one part, and then you just pay like five bucks shipping for the other part, and you have something really cool. And this goes in there. And here's Kylo. Like I said, we want to keep him in the house because we don't know if he'll run away. And Smokey's back in the house. And Tug's back in the house. Spotted Leaf is somewhere. There she is. There's Spotted Leaf. Aww. White Storm, what's this about? So I came out here to show you guys that Don just finished burying the edge of the greenhouse. So no wild animals getting in there. Right? Oh yeah? Yeah? You don't want that to happen. Nope. Sure don't. Nope. Work put into this. Yeah, he doesn't want it to blow away and he doesn't want the deer or the rabbits eating what we grow. Or how the neighbors ducks and chickens get into it either. Yeah. Which still got a bunch of fencing off to do it too, yeah. Yeah. But there are in that pen over there is a bunch of ducks and chickens. 
and they get to go outside and play. And they might eat everything. Right, White Storm? Oh yeah, the ducks and chickens, they'll scratch out a garden in a hurry when you've got a garden going. Oh, I know. But we got some fence posts, but not enough. We'll have to get more. Yeah, because it's not just the greenhouse. It is also this whole garden area over here. That's going to be, become a garden area eventually. Yeah. Maybe it's not going to happen this year, but maybe next year. Here's some fence posts, but we have to get more and then put fences fences around it, or a fence. Yeah. Or the animals will just eat everything. Yeah, and I'm thinking about coming off in the corner of the greenhouse, the front corner, coming down, going across that way, then coming back up, and then connecting at the back corner. Yeah, makes sense. Just make sure there's a, a door or something oh, yeah, <laughs> so we can get in and gate. out of there. Yeah, I'm thinking about putting a gate right in, right in the area where you're standing. Oh, okay. I just got a uh, rototilla thin strip in right here. Yeah. So that way it comes out and meets up with the edge of the greenhouse. Yep. So this whole area needs to get uh, rototilled again. Ro uh, rototilled again. Yeah. Might not get a garden in this year, but hopefully next year. Yeah. Plans in the makings anyway. Yep. And it did not thunderstorm, so it's still really, really humid. Yeah, I'm sweating up pretty good. Uh, pretty good uh, beads of sweat here. Yeah. Yeah, shirt starting to get wet from sweating and stuff. Out here working on the greenhouse, moving dirt around. Well, we're gonna make dinner soon, which is just venison, mashed potatoes, and vegetables. But I'm gonna go ahead and end this because. It's getting pretty late now, and it's getting longer. So we're going to say good night, and we hope you enjoyed the video, and that you like, subscribe, comment, share, and you're having a good night. Oh, and if you made it this far, and you were ever interested in anything in my Etsy shop, I have free shipping on everything now. Say good night. Say good morning. And we'll see you next time.